Welcome to Brand Management Course Unit Market Potential and Sales Forecasting Topic Classification of Sales Forecasting Techniques Let us understand the general methods of sales forecasting under qualitative techniques It includes market research, panel consensus, historical analogy, Delphi method, expert evaluation technique jury of executive opinion so what is market research market research is used mostly for product research in the sense of looking for new product ideas like and dislikes about existing products which competitive products within a particular class are preferred and so on historical analogy in trying to forecast demand for a new product an ideal situation would be where an existing product or a generic product could be used as a model so there are many ways to classify such analogies for example complementary products substitute or competitive products and products as a function of income the delphi method the delphi method conceals the identity of the individuals participating in the forecasting everyone has the same weight procedurally a moderator creates a questionnaire and distributes it to participants their responses are summoned and given back to the entire group along with a new set of questions expert evaluation techniques in this technique the experience of people is used it includes executives sales people marketing people distributors or outside experts uh, these experts are familiar with the product line or a group of products that are responsible to generate sales forecast it includes combining inputs from multiple sources the advantage of expert evaluation techniques are soliciting contributions from more than one person it helps in offsetting biases into a forecast next is jury of executive opinion in this technique jury of executive such as finance marketing sales production logistics etc meet to generate forecast the opinions of this executives are considered the jury of executive opinion is one of the most familiar and frequently used technique of all forecasting techniques the effective use of the jury of executive opinion technique depends on the degree to which the organization is able to overcome the sources of bias it includes the bias of individuals particularly group decision making etc the most frequent source of bias is the consensus forecasting context is political pressure within the company it is usually in the form of influence exerted by the member of the jury whose department is the most powerful within the culture of the company because of this influence the contributions from other member of the jury carry relatively less weight in the final forecast demand estimation technique business enterprises needs to know the demand for its product an existing unit must know current demand for its product in order to avoid underproduction or overproduction the current demand should be known for determining pricing and promotional policies it is able to secure optimum sales or maximum profit such information about the current demand for the firm's product is known as demand estimation demand estimation is a process of finding current values of demand or various value of prices and other determining variables so steps in demand estimation includes identification of independent variables like price price of substitute population per capita income advertisement expenditure etc next is collection of data of the variables from past records next step is development of mathematical model or equation to indicate that relationship between independent and dependent variables estimation of the parameters of the model last step is development of estimates based on the model the last technique is salesforce composite method the salesforce composite is a qualitative forecasting method that uses the knowledge and experience of a company sales people its sales management and channel members to produce sales forecast the grassroots approach to a sales force uh, composite accumulates sales forecast for the regions products consumers etc general methods of sales forecasting under quantitative techniques it includes time series analysis simple moving average analysis uh, weighting moving average method exponential smoothing method let us understand these techniques starting with time series analysis time series analysis is based on the idea that data relating to past demand can be used to predict future demand so past data may include several components such as trend and uh, seasonal or cyclic influences simple moving average method it uses an average of a specified number of the most recent observations with each observation receiving the same emphasis that is weight weighted moving average method it uses an average of the specific uh, number of the most recent observations with each observation receiving a different emphasis that is weight 
each of the observation used to compute the forecasted value that is weighted equally. Lastly, exponential smoothing method. This is a type of uh, weighted moving average forecasting techniques in which past observations are geometrically discounted according to their age. The heaviest weight is assigned to the most recent data. The techniques make use of smoothing constant to apply the difference between the most recent forecast and critical sales data. Thank you.